Hello and welcome to another lesson with Global Project Control YouTube channel. In this lesson, uh, we want to talk about update progress. But at the part one, I want to describe uh, some definition. We have three type of percent complete type in Primavera P6. You can find uh, this percent complete type at the software over here. In uh, the software, in activity sheet, in detail window, if you uh, click on the general tab and then go to percent complete type, you can select duration, physical, or unit percent complete type. But what is the difference? Uh, if you want to uh, your activity uh, update by duration, you can select duration percent complete type. In these activities, duration drive all other things. But if you want to uh, select unit percent complete type, it means that you want to calculate from actual and remaining unit. So, if you change an status, if you change the percent complete type over here, the amount of labor unit updated automatically, but the remaining does not change. But what about physical? When you want to uh, update uh, by physical, it means that you want to update manually. You want to update manually your project. It's very useful method of update in construction. We have three type of percent complete type, but we have four duration type. It depends on your activities. But I'm listed over here. And I provide you some uh, short description over here. But let me just show you what happened to your activity for each percent complete type and duration type of activities. These are the same activity within 20 days of original du duration. Each activity have a one labor resource. Uh, it's, uh, alloc I allocated 240 uh, budgeted unit to each resource and I want to update uh, these activities to provide you better understanding of updating progress in Primavera P6. The first activity, I name it duration. It's the fixed duration and unit type of duration type and percent complete type is duration. So I named this activity is duration. I come back to a status tab. If I check the start button and I import percent complete type of activity over here by percentage. For instance, 10%. You can find the labor unit updated and the remaining duration is updated too. But what about physical activity in fixed duration and unit? I push the check mark for a start button, but I only use 10%, but nothing happened. So I can enter this field manually, for instance, 48. But you can find the remaining duration does not change. I want to update remaining duration to 18 days. 
But when I update the remaining duration to 18 days, the actual will be changed automatically. Why? Because my activity is fixed duration and unit. So if I change my duration, my units updated. But what about activity with unit type? of percent complete type is unit. If I click start activity and then use 10% of progress, my actual updated automatically by update of percentage, but the remaining duration are not changed. If I enter 19 days, all things updated. Why? Because my activity type is fixed duration and unit. My remaining duration updated my actual and my actual updated my percentage. Now let's to talk about another type of duration, type of Primavera P6. In fixed duration and unit time, uh, we focus on activity to be completed within a fixed time period regardless of resource assigned. In this activity, the work is very important for us. Also, duration for fixed work estimated and it's not change. But if uh, we select uh, duration type for progress registration, if uh, I put 10% progress over here, uh, all things updated. For physical, like previous one, if I only 10% progress, nothing change. But if I used to 24 over here, uh, I can register my actual progress and I want to register my remaining duration too. So uh, I uh, enter 19 days, but my actual decrease. Why? Uh, because uh, my unit per time is fixed and if also my duration is fixed so uh, for each day i only can use to 20 budget because according to this activity i can use to 12 budget labor unit per day so if my remaining duration decrease for one day the actual uh, labor unit in maximum can use to 12 uh, budget labor unit if i use 20 the budget labor unit change why because i i enter another estimation for one day budget labor unit usage then i enter new digit over here it means that this activity rate for each day is 20 so my budgeted labor unit recalculate by software by how let me to show you i have my original duration is 20, so I have 20. My budgeted labor unit for each day is 20, so 20 multiply 20 is 14, 400. So my estimation for budgeted labor unit changed completely. And my remaining duration and my add complete duration updated by software but what about if i 
change my activity percent complete type to unit and my duration type is fixed duration and unit time if i update my activity to the 10 percent my actual labor unit updated over here my remaining duration my labor unit actual is calculated by software to 24 and my remaining duration is updated too but if i changed my remaining duration because of my percent complete type and considering with my duration type my done work is changed because i affected the work let me to change it but if i change the remaining duration consider with my percent complete type is unit and my duration type is fixed duration and unit time unit type means work so if i change it because my duration and my work is fixed the done work is fixed too actual is fixed but the percent complete type recalculate because my add complete and my remaining estimation is totally changed based off my remaining duration maybe you think that's so complex but uh, you set up it at the first of project and then you update it this is very helpful let's talk about fixed unit duration type if your percent complete type is duration and your duration type is fixed unit and you enter 10% of progress you register I register 10% of progress nothing change over here because I have a fixed unit activity but my duration is changed over here but how I can put my actual manually if I use the unit for this activity everything change automatically but be careful if you enter the percent at the first you should change it to the zero and then you stop it by these tools and what about physical physical is manually so i can enter the percent complete over here nothing change but i prefer to use unit because i have a fixed unit duration type so i prefer to use unit i enter 20 over here my remaining updated and i can use another digit over here it's up to you for physical but about unit because my duration type is fixed unit and my percent complete type is unit 2 i used to actual over unit everything updated and what about unit per time it means work if my duration type is unit time and my activity type is duration activity percent complete type means and i enter 10 percent progress into my project nothing change over unit but my remaining duration is changed so i update it by zero and then used to actual in order to update my project by unit because i should enter the work and you can calculate the work unit over here but this type of activity about physical like the previous one this field is up to you you can use update by yourself this is for physical activities percent complete is only guideline and for actual if i enter 48 my remaining and my labor unit connected to each other but if change the remaining duration to 80 my actual unit is fixed because it's related to my 
work and my remaining and my add complete updated. But what about unit? Unit percent complete type with unit per time duration type. If I enter the progress over here for 20%, actual and remaining duration are changed automatically. But if I want to change remaining duration by myself to 40, done work, fix remaining duration and add complete, recalculate by software, and also my progress is recalculate based on my remaining duration. This is the type of duration and type of percent complete type in Primavera P6. Each of these designed for special activities. For instance, you can use fixed unit activity when the total amount of work is fixed and increasing the resource can decrease the duration. It's, uh, I have a very good sample for this type of activity, uh, like rough grading at the site. If you increase your equipment, your resources to the site, you can, you can do the job in a, in a less duration. So, uh, rough grading is a very good sample. And also, fixed duration and unit is a very good sample for task-dependent activities. You can select your duration type and percent complete type based on your activity. We say very enough about the uh, duration type and percent complete type affected to each other. So as a result, I would like to present you this table. This table helps you for better understanding of operation these parameters to each other on the software. I provide you this short article. I share it via my LinkedIn. If you need to have it, Please uh, drop me a comment and share your email address. I will send it to you. Thank you for your time. I hope this lesson would be useful for you. Please keep in touch with my LinkedIn, YouTube, and Instagram for further lesson. Also, you can follow my hashtag Global Project Control in order to find all of my lesson in the same page. Thank you for your subscription in my channel.